Dear future doctors, today you are joining with the third part of the IMAT paper discussion of the academic year 2021. Up to now, uh, we have discussed several questions and still we are in the first section. We need to complete uh, biology, chemistry, physics. I think in the future, uh, we will be able to complete them with our new videos. Anyhow, in the first part, uh, we have discussed question numbers 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. And uh, in the second part, we discussed about the question numbers 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. On the right top corner, uh, on YouTube, you will be able to find a icon with information. So if you click it, you will be able to find the links or else uh, in the description uh, i will attach the links for the previous parts you can uh, watch them and have an idea about those questions as well without a further ado let's move to the 11th question and uh, yeah the 11th question is which one of the following pairs scholar field of study is not correct we have five answers a. John Maynard Keynes, his field is economics. B. Hans Jonas, given field is medicine. C. Maria Montessori, given field is pedagogy. D. B. F. Skinner, psychology. E. Max Planck, physics. Now I will give you five seconds. Within these five seconds, I want you to pause the video and uh, find an answer. After these five seconds, we will discuss what is the correct answer. Okay, so your time starts now. Time up. So the correct answer is B, Hans Jonas. Now, let's see about each of these people. And starting with John Maynard Keynes. He's the first Baron Keynes and was an English economist whose ideas fundamentally changed the theory and practice of macroeconomics and the economic policies of governments. Originally trained in mathematics, he built on and greatly refined earlier work on the causes of business cycles. So his name match with his field. Moving to B, Hans Jonas. Hans Jonas was a German-born American Jewish philosopher. From 1955 to 1976, he worked as a professor of philosophy at the New School for Social Research in New York City. So his contribution towards medicine has been very low because he was a professor of philosophy. So his field of work is philosophy. So that's the reason the answer is not correct and we have to select the false answer therefore b has been selected but let's look at the other people as well c we have maria montessori maria tecla artemisia montessori was an italian physician and educator best known for the philosophy of education that bears her name and her writing on scientific pedagogy at an early age, Montessori enrolled in classes at an all-boys technical school with hopes of becoming an engineer. But eventually, she uh, became a wonderful educator and uh, still her method of teaching for kindergarten students is uh, practiced and uh, she has changed a lot of things related to that field. So, yes her name and the field match with each other d <coughs> b f skinner burhus frederick skinner i don't know whether i'm pronouncing correct or not if there is a mistake kindly comment under the comment section so i will correct my uh, pronunciations for the next videos anyways he was an american psychologist behaviorist author inventor and social philosopher he was a professor of psychology at Harvard University from 1958 until his retirement in 1974. So his name also matched with his field. E. Max Planck. Max Karl Ernest Ludwig Planck. He was a German theoretical physicist 
whose discovery of energy quanta won him the Nobel Prize in physics in 1918. So his name also matched with his field. Moving to the 12th question. Which one of the following writers is the author of the best-selling novel My Brilliant Friend? We have A. Khalid Hosseini, B. Elena Ferrante, C. Ian McEwan, D. Kazuo Ishiguro, E. Paolo Coelho. I will give you five seconds now. Okay. Time up and the correct answer is B. Elena Ferrante. Let's look at all these authors first. We have Khalid Hosseini. Khalid Hosseini is an Afghan-American novelist and UNHCR Goodwill Ambassador. His debut novel, The Kite Runner, was a critical and commercial success. After that, he wrote several books and uh, A Thousand Splendid Sons and The Mountain Echoed, Sea Prayer, The Kite Runner graphic novel. And The Kite Runner has another version as well. And Way More Than Luck. Uh, his early work he has written so many other books as well if you have time go through them and uh, when we consider about Elena Ferrante she is a pseudonymous Italian novelist her books originally published in Italian but all of them have translated into many other languages so her earlier works are as follow L'amore molesto the English translation is Troubling Love. Then I Giorni del Abbandono. The English translation is The Days of Abandonment. La Frantumaia. The English version is also Frantumaia. And uh, the Filia Oscura. The English version is The Lost Daughter. La Spiaggia di Notte. The English version is The Beach at Night. And uh, L'Amica Geniale, the English version is My Brilliant Friend. So Elena Ferrante is the writer of the book My Brilliant Friend. But as we are discussing about other authors, we are moving to the answer C also. Ian McEwan. Ian Russell McEwan is an English novelist and screenwriter. In 2008, the Times featured him on its list of the 50 greatest British writers since 1945. Uh, his books are as The Cement Garden, The Comfort of Strangers, The Child in Time, The Innocent, Black Dogs, Enduring Love. Moving to answer D, Kazuo Ishiguro. Uh, Sir Kazuo Ishiguro is a British novelist, screenwriter, musician and short story writer. He was born in uh, Nagasaki, but then he has moved to Britain. And he wrote A Pal, uh, Weave of Hills, An Artist of the Floating World, The Remains of the Day, The Unconsoled, When We Were Orphans, Never Let Me Go. And some other books, they are very, very beautiful. If you have time, go through them. And moving to answer E, we have Paolo Coelho. Paolo Coelho di Soiza. He's the writer of the novel The Alchemist. That novel has sold more than 150 million copies worldwide and is the all-time best-selling book by a Brazilian writer. And other than that, he wrote O Diario de Um Mago and uh, the English version is The Pilgrimage and uh, Veronica Dice de Morer Veronica Decides to Die, Onze Minutos, the English version is 11 minutes, and uh, Manual do Guerreiro da Luz, the English version is Manual of the Warrior of Light, and Brida, Brida is a famous one, and the English version also Brida, and if you have time, go through all these books, they are really fantastic and very interesting but they are not related to IMAT so uh, yeah if you have time only you can go through them but yeah 
We are moving to the 13th question and the 13th question is what does the letter A stands for the organization FAO? Answer A, architecture B, aesthetics C, aerospace D, agriculture and E, automotive. Your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is agriculture because FAO stands for Food and Agriculture Organization. Food and Agriculture Organization. Moving to the 14th question. Which of the following pairs of theater city is the only correct one? That means the other four are completely wrong. So we have uh, A as uh, La Fenice in Florence, B San Carlo Venice, C Metropolitan Opera House in New York, D Bolshoi Theater in St. Petersburg, E the Palais Garnier Opera House in Brussels. Your time starts now. Time up. So the correct answer is C, Metropolitan Opera House, New York. Let's see why the others are incorrect. La Fenice is not in Florence, it's in Venice. San Carlo is in Napoli. And it's a huge theatre. I, I was lucky to visit it once. And uh, yeah, uh, it's it, if you visit it once, definitely you will never forget it. And if you are in Italy, I highly recommend you to visit San Carlo. And uh, C, Metropolitan Opera House in New York, it's the correct answer. And uh, D, the Bolshoi Theatre, it's in Moscow, Russia. E, the Palais Garnier Opera House, it's in Paris. Okay. Moving to the 15th question, the Rosetta Stone provided the key to decipher a characters of the ancient greek alphabet b the code of hammurabi c the sumerian language d egyptian hieroglyphs e characters of the phoenician alphabet now your time starts time up and uh, the correct answer is D, Egyptian hieroglyphs. Actually, I thought of uh, showing you this stone. When I was in high school, I was able to uh, have a look and it was really fantastic. It had three parts and uh, in this white uh, picture, we can see the three parts of the stone. So the first part is um with egyptian hieroglyphs and uh, the second part is also egyptian uh, demotic letters and the third part uh, is greek letters so initially they have been used to translate these egyptian hieroglyphs to other letters so the answer is d moving to the 16th question which one of the following institutions of the European Union is elected by direct universal suffrage? Suffrage means the uh, right to vote. So which has been selected by voting of the people? A. European Commission B. European Parliament C. Council of the European Union D. European Economic and Social Committee E. Court of Justice of the European Union your time starts now. Time up. And the correct answer is B, European Parliament. So with that question for today, discussion is over. I hope to um, see you with the future videos we are planning to discuss all the questions and uh, we'll try to make it as soon as possible anyhow i would like to mention our main sponsor cherithrovi.com and the news for the student is 
we are developing the courses hopefully in january we will be able to launch all the courses so there will be a course for biology a course for physics and another course for chemistry depending on your requirement you can select a single course or you can uh, follow all the courses uh, and uh, most of the time it will be free so do not hesitate to register in our website and um, i would like to appreciate your attention once again and um, thank you so much for being with us thank you for joining in the group and uh, thank you for sharing your experiences and your knowledge with uh, other members it's really really it's really good and i would like to wish you a good study session maybe before the christmas i will be able to uh, upload another video but if in any case if i am not able to upload um merry merry christmas